guys, welcome back once again to my channel. Today we are going to play some more Star Stable. I'm back on Justine's account, and we are going to um, going to be going to the Winter Village. Let's see. Ho-ho, these are sad times. You don't understand, there's no winter. No winter? That's the problem. Oh, you humans haven't considered what happens what happens to Christmas when everything has... Oh, you humans haven't considered what happens to Christmas when everything starts getting warm, haven't you? I can't read, apparently. Oh, oh, you humans haven't considered what happens to Christmas when everything starts getting warmer, have you? What happens to cr the Christmas spirit when the snow is gone from Jorvik? What you didn't think of that when you drilled for oil and everyone revealed, did you? That wasn't me. That wasn't you? Oh, well, lucky for you, Santa has solved the problem. It's, if Christmas can't come to Jorvik, then Jorvik must come to Christmas. Step aboard the sleigh, dear rider, step aboard and let, let us fly to the winter village. I plan on buying some horses today. Welcome to the Winter Village. Thank you. You should go talk to the big guy himself. He wants to greet all visitors personally. You have been, been naughty this year, have you? Ho ho. Just ride down the slope through the Winter Village. You're sure to see him. Goodbye and Merry Christmas. This is the first Christmas I've had that, that I've had on Justine's account. And yes, it's way past Christmas, but oh well. Oh ho, welcome to the Winter Village, a jolly place where all your holiday dreams come true. At least I hope they do. I just, I just, I, I must confess, Justine, I am a bit anxious about this Christmas. You see, I decided to give my usual team of elves a vacation call. And call in some temporary workers. These little helpers are. How can I put this? Delight. Dilip. And how would I put this? Dilicically enthusiastic. Uh, they try. Oh, they try. But if I'm entirely honest, I'm not sure they entirely grasp the Christmas, the spirit of Christmas. They're quite harmless and quite merry once you. Get to know them. Please enjoy your time here in the Winter Village and come back uh, back often. Ho ho, I trust you are I trust you are having a wonderful time here in my Winter Village. It's excellent. The little helpers I hired to fill in for my vacationing elves have really embraced the Christmas the spirit of Christmas. At first, I was worried that they that with the teeth and horns, the helpers would be more scary than Mary, but they, they've they really grown on me. I'm a bit concerned that some of the team leaders haven't sent their daily reports running Christmas is no easy task. Perhaps these little helpers could use a little help of, could use a little help of their own, but I'm so busy myself with all these little recheck, with all these lists to recheck. If only there was someone to ass assist me. I shouldn't have known you'd volunteer. After all, you're right at the top of my list. <laughs> now, let's see here. I'm missing reports from three little helpers. Pongle, Zingle, and Krangle. The little helper named Pongle is 
is as kind and warm as a roasted chestnut. If a bit, the little helper named Pongle is is as kind and warm as ro as a roasted chestnut. If a bit war warrior, if a bit of warrior. That's why I made him my chef security helper. He was supposed to send me a safety report, but I haven't heard from him all day. He currently he's currently stationed by the frozen lake. Perhaps you can go check in on him. Sure. Tell me truthfully, young lady. I'm fashionable. I'm a fashionable fellow, aren't I? The fuzzy red suit, the tummy cinching belt. You could say I'm a fashion icon. Zingle, the little helper in charge of stocking our holiday fashions, thinks otherwise. He's been pressuring me to throw out my closet and get a total makeover. But what if I don't want to be fierce? It's, isn't it cozy? Isn't it cozy enough? Speaking of Zingle, he hasn't te text. He's been texting nonstop. What do you think these emojis mean? S sweating 100% on fire? That isn't good. I miss the d the good old days when everyone communicated with one with handwriting handwritten messages with handwritten letters and lists sigh maybe you can go check on zingle behind the clothes clothing bo boutique and make sure everything make sure things aren't unraveling why is christmas without com comforting baked goods to warm the heart and tummy i am and i am something of i am something of a cookie consumer I know my way around your snickerdoodles and chocolate chip varieties. This season, season though, there's a new cook mean, mean, meaning the cooking station. Oh, excuse me, a new pasture. Kringle is a very par particular and distinction. Kringle and I had a few heated debates about what constitutes cons a cookie after a few discussions cookie experts we settle on tradition ice gingerbread i thought everything was running like a well oiled skillet but krangle still hasn't sent me his daily report maybe he you can go check up on him sure are you a health inspector no phew i was worried you were here to shut this cafe down you're probably wondering what my con confections are doing on the kitchen floor what my cookies are doing on the kitchen floor. You're probably wondering what my cookies are doing on the kitchen floor. This cookie baking gig should have been a cakewalk. But someone sabotaged my recipe. Oh no. I'm way overqualified to act as Santa's direct direct of cookie operations. Did I let that stop me from taking the job? No. I saw it as a chance to, chance to push my craft. The boss wants sugar cookies and gingerbread. I'm I'm way I'm way too I'm way too I'm way over qualified to act as Santa's director of cookie operations. Did I let that stop me from? I'm way over qualified. I'm way over qualified to act as Santa's director of cookie operations. Did I let that stop me from taking the job? No. I saw it as a chance. To, uh, I'm way overqualified, Dr. Santos. Direct. I'm way overqualified, Dr. Santos, director of cookie operations. Did I let that stop me from taking the job? No. I saw it as a chance chance to push my craft. The boss wants sugar, sugar cookies and gingerbread. I can't. I can do that. Buy my spin flat. My spin flower to pedestrians. Let's go. Let's go spell. No oven. That then I will bake on campfire. That's what Christmas is all about, right? Thinking outside the box. But then someone went and swapped out my curry powder with cinnamon. Can you imagine? Wait. Yeah. But then someone went and swapped out my curry powder with cinnamon. Can you imagine gingerbread with cinnamon notes? What is this? 1922? My, my curry ginger crisp would have 
blown your taste buds. No way I could sell these boring cookies. Okay, so I lost my temper a little. Dumped the whole batch onto the ground. It's not too late to bake a new batch the right way, but someone's got to deal with this mess. I'm making you my honorary sous chef. Take this broom and sweep up the bat into batch before any customers or real health inspectors show up and careful with the broom with vintage. Oh my god, friend request. Sure. One pile. Two pile. Three pile. Five pile. Six pile. Hey, nice job sweeping up the mess. Ah, uh, don't look so don't look sad about it. Sure, those cookies look delicious, but they don't respect my artistic vision, you know. Maybe I'll save a few of the unbroken ones for that Santa guy, for a so-called cookie concierge. He was really he has really low standards. Uh. Finally, I can get back to the back to baking forgot curry i'm going to try something new totally outside the box you probably never heard of it it's oats they're all the rage in william williamsburg right now wait you're telling me the oats are quite normal around these parts that's unexpected i have to meditate on this but about that last batch i'm certain somebody tried to sabotage my baking Someone here is jealous of my baking mastery. It has to be. Santa should know about this. You let him know when you give him my report. Got it. Let's go find this next guy. Where's this next guy? B -b boss Cl boss Claus sent you? I'm fired, aren't I? Ah, oh, jeez, I should have known my my job was on the nice. Just give me a few minutes to pack my things. What's that? I'm not fired? You heard help? Well, why didn't you say why didn't you say so soon there? Huh. As chief as chef safety helper. Oh wait. I said I've seen chef. I meant chief safety helper. It's my it's my job in to enforce proper ice tr travel cells technique and minimizing slips, falls, tumbles, I take my job very seriously. Lately, things have gotten terrible, da terribly dangerous. There are branches scattered all over the lake. Someone could be take a nasty slip. It had, it has to be, it has me so worried. I can't think straight. I'm going to have to close down the lake. It's the only way to ensure no one gets hurt unless you you have to pick up the pick up the branches scattered across the frozen lake safety. That's what Christmas is all about. That's what you say.
Okay, sir. Break out the tinsel. The lake is safe. Although, if you ask me, Christmas would be a lot safer if people and horses stayed off the ice altogether. A cozy indoor Christmas where no one could get hurt. That would be delightful. But that's not how it works. Something is still bothering me about the mess on the lake. A few branches here or there could have snapped off the trees. But all those piles have had to have been deliberately deliberate. It's like someone wanted the lake to get shut down. That makes no sense. It says right here on the standard contract, all of us little helpers signed then when we took the job. Maximum for merit and promote jo joyless and with all guests. Boss Claus should know about this. Can you let him know about the branches and give him my apologies for the late report? I won't let him down again. Sure. We just have to go here. Close. Why, hello there, stranger. Why, what are you wearing? My device snap for my gram? Don't worry, you're flawless. But enough about you. I'm Zingle, and even if... Even if you haven't heard of me, you'll be wearing me soon enough. The Chris Christmas, I'm low. I'm a lowly warehouse helper. Helper, but next year I'm design. I'm designing all new clothes. After all, being fabulous is what Christmas is all about. It's not. If only boutique was a immaculate, as immaculate as enthusiastic. As you can see, it's a uh, catastrophic. It's catastrophic. I think that's the word. It was like this when I arrived this morning. Someone broke into our stock of the season's top fashions and dumped them onto the ground like rejects at a simple sale. Oh, you gorgeous puffers and knits. Why? What have they done to you? I'm so shocked. I could barely stand. Where's a pumpkin spice latte when you need one? You'll pick them up, won't you? You'll pick them up? Won't you? Of course you will. You're a fierce horsey lady. <laughs> Nothing can stop you. Not even a horrible mess. Sure. Wait, what did he say? I still see clothes on the ground. You simply must pick them up. Oh, fast. What kind of monster would treat fashion like that? If you showed up when you did, if you hadn't shown up when you did, the only clothes left for Christmas would be be ugly sweaters. Help me. I can't bear to think of it. This was no accident, horse lady. This was sabotage. Santa needs to know. You'll tell him, won't you? And you, remain, you remind him about my fashion tips. That jolly man dresses to slay. But if he took my advice, he could dress to play. Let me slay. Alright, let's go back. Someone sabotaged Krangle's curry co ginger cookie recipe? Well, I can't say I blame them, but on a principle, sabotaging someone at ba someone's baking is a very naughty thing to do. Most troubling. So thank you for checking in on P Pongle. This business with the p branches is concerning, but I won't start jiggling the alarms just yet. Or jingling the uh, yeah, jingling the alarms just yet. I'm sure there's a perfectly reasonable explanation. You sorted things out with our little fashionista. Zingle showed me his designs for next year's fashion. Next year's fashion, and they're they're they are quite creative. Mrs. Claus usually hand, hand, 
handles our fashion holiday fashion but perhaps we could let him design a t-shirt he does try so hard this business with the sabotage is quite unsettling could, could it really be a round rough little helper i thought our team building seminar had had been quite efficient apparently i was wrong Alright guys, that's it for today. Alright guys, that's it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't you guys forget to subscribe and comment and like. And don't you guys forget to turn your post notifications on so you guys want to upload my next video. Thank you guys for watching. Bye. I'm just gonna get the nails here.